Welcome. So, okay, so for my first vid, I'm just going to talk about, like, why I am the way I am and just give you, like, a little rundown on me. I want this to be, like, a fun but mental health party day in the life vlog of me. Um, and I think it's going to be really cool. I just finished school like three weeks ago. I went to school for like six years for nutrition and I loved it. But just like every other 23 year old, I have no idea what I'm doing with my life at all. So yeah, I'm starting this vlog. I moved here to Cleveland like a year ago and I love it. And the weather is really great. And it's really safe around here. No, I really do love Cleveland and I started working at this really cool job as a server when I was in my program to be a registered dietitian last year and I met really, really cool people and it's kind of why I am the way I am and I'm going to get into that, but I just woke up and I'm drinking one coffee and I definitely need to drink a second coffee to even talk to you guys, so I'm going to go make my second coffee and then I'll talk to you. Miso. Miso. Come here. So. Sorry. I'm like. I'm honestly really hungover right now. But yeah. So pretty much. Let's, let's just make the first video. Let's cut right to the fucking chase. Why don't we? Yeah. Um. So yeah. Pretty much. I got in this like really fucking bad accident in August. Um, I got hit by a drunk driver. Um, almost died pretty much. My car like caught on fire and it was, it was pretty bad. Um, but um, it sucked. Mentally was traumatized. Um, went through a slight depression. And that lasted for a little bit. You know, I still have my days, but like, they told me I wasn't going to be able to walk for a few months, and I was able to within, like, a month. So, I took it as, like, let's live life, you know? Um, and there's this one girl that I worked with. She messaged me, like, after my accident when she was like, Michaela, like, you were given a second chance for a reason. So, like, hold on to that on, your like, your bad days. And I think about that at least once or twice a day. Like every decision I'm going to make, I'm like, yeah, like I, I'm supposed to be doing this. I'm supposed to be, if I'm given a cool opportunity, it's for a reason. So after my accident, after like a month and month or two, um, me and all my friends had a trip planned for Portland, Oregon. I remember like being in the hospital and everyone's like, we're gonna make you go to Portland. And like, don't worry, like we're gonna wheel you around in a wheelchair if we have to. And my parents are like, you're not going to fucking Portland. And I'm like, I'm going to fucking Portland. Like, I'm going to fucking Portland. We were going to see Tame Impala, which is my favorite band. And you bet your fucking ass, I went to Portland. And it was the best trip of my absolute life. Like, me and my friends, like, never slept for the whole trip. We just, we just laughed. Like, we literally sat up and listened to music and laughed every single night. I mean, we just went and we explored every single day. I still had a cast on and my legs were kind of messed up, but like my friends were just so cool and supportive of like making sure I felt comfortable with everything. Like even in the concert, like I always had people around me, like it was just so wholesome. So whatever, I go to Portland, it was so much fun. We make all these memories, do all these cool things. And we're coming back from Portland, going back to Ohio. And my two best friends are like, do you want to go to LA in like two weeks? I'm like, dude, no, like I have no fucking money. I have, I haven't worked. Like I'm crippled as fuck. And like LA is like, you know, we're going to go party and do cool shit. Um, so I was like, whatever, fuck it. Like whatever. I was on this high of life. I was like, I'll go. 
Um, so whatever, come home for two weeks, pack our shit up, and we go to LA. And it was like just like another great trip. And like, it was like these two trips like made me realize anything is like literally possible. So this is literally the beginning of a fucking era. I just think 2022 is the year that I do probably the coolest shit of my entire life. Literally take advantage of opportunities. If something gets handed to you, the universe gave it to you for a reason. You literally should look at yourself in the mirror every single day while you're brushing your teeth, while you're washing your face and say what you want. And I know that is so like easier said than done, but it literally takes 10 seconds. And I'm telling you that my life in these past six months have changed so much because I changed my brain. I never, I never was like this as a kid. I was never like this in college a year ago, literally a year ago. If I, if you would've told me that this is what I was doing after I just finished six years of school, I would've been like, what the fuck, Michaela? I'm gonna still like, you know, I'm not gonna throw away my degree. I'm gonna, I'm still gonna sit and take my like board's exam to become a registered dietitian. And I can utilize that in this video. And you know, I can, I'm gonna show you guys like little healthy hacks that I do that make me feel really good because I do have, I have a whole like routine in the morning. Um, and that has to do with like food, supplements, mental things I do. Um, yeah, I'm gonna just fucking show you my life, so. It's probably, I probably should get in the shower. Um, I've had this self tanner on for like two days now and I need to wash it off, so. I'm gonna take a shower and get ready for work. And yeah, see where the fucking wind takes me. This was a really interesting first vlog. I'm not gonna lie, I already recorded like last week a whole first vlog um, and I've been editing it for like a week and a half now and today I like finished it and I closed my laptop and I was like, I fucking hate it. And I wanted to redo the whole thing because it wasn't, not that I didn't feel like I wasn't being myself, but I was like trying too hard to be a, a vlogger where I'm like, the whole point of this vlog, I'm like listening to myself talk and I'm like, the whole point of this vlog is me trying to say to be yourself and I'm not really being myself. So if it takes me another week to post what I really wanna post, I'm gonna do that. Um, and that's one thing I'll say is that I promise to always be really real and up like i'm gonna be honest like i'm gonna be super honest about the way i feel about things because i'm a super passionate person i'm a gemini so if you made it this far and you aren't cringing at the sound of my voice yet then thank you um i really appreciate it and i promise that my cap won't be so bad next time she is also uh, the best thing that ever happened to my mental health. When I got her, my heart got warm. Bye. Okay, thank you so much for watching my first vlog. And um, the next one I won't be so hungover in and it'll be more fun. I have some, I have some tricks up my sleeve for you guys. That was so cute, oh my God. That was like adorable. I can't believe I just got that on freaking film. Can you not? All right, bye.